I received quite a lot of questions about removing the silicon glue from your brushes when it builds up like this. I don't recommend that you use your fingers to pull it. You may find in here that there are splinters of glass which obviously you're then going to put into your fingers. So try and get a craft blade like this. This is really nice and bendy. A nice hard surface. Put your brush down onto the surface and just cut it off. Do the same on the other side. Now you want to be careful about this. You don't want to shave too many of the bristles off. But because this is nice and sharp and bendy, you're really just taking the top layer off. You will eventually take all the bristles off, but for now, I'm pulling it with my fingers now because I know that the majority of the splinters are in this bit of glue here. Okay, so I got to that. Now, it isn't a brush anymore. Basically, it's like a glue spreader and that's perfect for what you want. But if you want to clean it up more, you can use something like this and just run it through the bristles, pulling it like that, and then you will pull out more glue. And then you should just be able to pull off the excess because you've broken it up. Okay, there you go. And now you can carry on using that. In the end, you will end up with a bald paintbrush, but what I do with mine, because these are wooden stems, I sharpen one end to a point and the other end to a wedge, and I use them to pick out the glue between the tessera. And I just keep sharpening this until there's nothing left. That way you're not wasting anything.